Actually, Zachary did prove one thing, though. It proved that women are actually psychic in some way. Because a lot of the women would, would be using their computer and they would be saying, I feel like there's somebody watching me. And th a lot of women out there that were using Windows or their laptop or whatever with a camera sitting there set, w w w noticed that it felt like somebody was watching them at certain times of the day and stuff like that. So clinically, it actually did prove psychicness because they, 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 they would say, it feels like someone's watching me when, I, when I'm undressing and stuff like that. Like they could feel it. And so anyway, uh, one thing, the one thing that Zachary did prove by all his whatever things and all his camera tricks or whatever, accessing people's cameras, it actually did prove psychicness because a lot of the women would, would a lot of the young girls would say, I feel like there's someone watching me through my computer. And it's like, well, actually, the, yes, there was. A lot of people were watching you through your computer, especially if you own Windows. Anyway, anyway, a lot of people post this to the web and also post this in videos and basically say, yes, the, the government, not only, not only the government, but also Zachary and a bunch of other horny young men basically do have access to your cameras uh, through your cell phones as well as your, as well as your, uh, your Windows operating system, which is why um, uh, North Korea does not use a United States system because it's been hacked and basically mutilated by basically Zachary and pretty much the Congress and a bunch of other people pretending to be alpha males or alpha or, or, the, or, the, or, the, or the, the men's gray or the most in touch men, basically. Like I said, what they would do is they would basically come up to girls using scripts. Basically, Zachary or some other guys would basically prepare lists of things that, the, that each girl liked. So the guys would just happen to bump into these women and basically happen to want to go to Paris or happen to be firefighters. Because the girls said, oh yeah, I think firefighters are hot. Or happened to be a rich man or whatever. They, they looked the part anyway. But actually, like I say, it was just all fake. It was just all information that they got from, from, from the people's computers or cell phones. So, anyway, and that's all Zachary Bill Gates really was. It was basically just someone using computers and basically someone using edited bank, bank accounts. Because anyone could actually start a bank. And then some people could, could walk up and go, oh, yeah, yeah, you know, I like this bank. I think I'm going to, going, going, to, going to put my money in this bank. It's, it looks like a good bank. You know, and they don't really know where their money is going or who actually has their money. And basically, banks can be completely, totally fake. And usually are. So, and actually possess no money at all. Not even printed money. Nor, nor any real coins. Like I said, everyone has to buy their coins from, from basically the United States Mint or the, the American Mint, pretty much. They call it the U.S. Mint, but it's not really the U.S. Mint. It's actually the, 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 the American Treasury, which is me. Uh, basically, um, Fort Knox and basically depends upon you know, everything else in a financial system. But other than that, it's basically just all in your head. You know, and certain people can actually take advantage of this and did very much so. Anyway, while people thought their money was safe and everything else and they actually actually had their money, Zachary and a bunch of other people were going, Alfa Romeo! Drugs! You know, and basically trying to spend their money in other countries, which generally my money is actually accepted in other countries as it is the money of the creator, you know, Lucifer Star, my money. So they actually do accept dollar bills in other countries, but, you know, Anyway, but once they get to a certain point, you know, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, that's why my money is actually accepted, because I am the actual creator. Anyway, and I chose my money. So anyway, and it's a pretty good financial system anyway, as long as it's not abused too much. But anyway, whatever. Uh, I was still able to get a lot of things built, and Zachary basically hit around and basically dated and lived the Alfa Romeo life. Anyway, but eventually, eventually, you probably come, come to, to understand who I am and find out that I am Lucifer Star. And not just Brian. And other people be like, Brian, Brian, shove it up your ass, Rodney. And Rodney would would, would basically be like, eh. you know, basically fucking with me this whole entire time, including saying, you're not going to win. You're never going to win. Anyway, and basically part of the whole Alfa Romeo group, are we? Brian. I'm not Brian. I'm Lucifer Star. Anyway, they just try and reinforce the fact or make everyone believe that I'm Brian because Brian is no one other than Lucifer Star. Actually, but Brian, even as Brian, I am Birmingham. Uh, um, uh, what's it called? Uh, uh, what's, what's it called? Uh, Berlin. Uh, and also... Blah, blah. 
ah, they get so annoying and fuck with me all the time. Anyway, though, but all this, this is very factual. Anyway, and trying to call me insane and everything else like that. And basically everybody, you know, all the real people that were actually, you know, running countries and everything else found, found out about these people. Like I said, this is why North Korea doesn't use the cell phones that everyone else does. That's why they make their own. Because they found out that I was right. People like Zachary and other people were, were abusing the system, basically spying on everyone and even having people assassinated as well as stealing their money, you know, using this information. The United States Congress. Zachary. That's how he knew who to hit and all that other stuff. Anyway, a bunch of people just pretend to be fake. It's just a whole bunch of basically fake paperwork. You know, you get enough people doing, doing something and they basically run around pretending to be rich or pretending to be someone. But they're not really anyone other than the fact that they're just people that lived inside of a house and got together with some other people and started being really, really annoying. Abuse of free will. That's why um, Germany was, was after them. And like I say, Germany is not just a country on the ground. It is a country in space. They have planets. Whole planets. And are very, 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 very well defended. More of a military style. And very much impregnable. So anyway, even though they lost the war on Earth, which they really didn't lose, they just kind of joined the mass. Pretty much. And there are still Germans in, in existence. You know, they just kind of bred into the society or whatever. Or retreated, you know, basically. You know, to go find me elsewhere. Anyway, they're actually from another planet. I believe Terran. Or some other planet like that. So, anyway, there are lots of planets out there and lots of colonies. So what happens on Earth doesn't really stay on Earth. Anyway, like I say, I don't care. I'm the superstar. And lots of people were trying to reinforce the fact that I was Brian, but Brian is the name of Lucifer Star. And lots of people would know that. Anyway, just because you put a small speaker somewhere or have some, some speaker somewhere, it doesn't mean you're anything. Like I said, they put a loop tape, tape at one point in time, annoying me for like 48 hours, which is very annoying and very wrong, thinking that nobody would ever find out about that, but they did. And like I said, not nearly as bad as basically... Nixon or JFK planning to kill everyone by launching the nuclear missiles. That's who was trying to kill you. And trying to blame Y2K. Or no, in 2K. Which was a which was supposed to be a a uh, a Chinese game, but not really a Chinese game. Anyway, whatever. Now they make games or whatever. Anyway, what what whatever. They're just some people, whatever. Blah blah. Anyway, it's just a symbol. To kill, basically. Anyway, a bunch, bunch of idiots wandering around behind, hiding behind logos and basically group names or company names pretending to be someone that they're not. Which is probably why people go postal every now and then. Because they get sick of the bullshit and know that it's bullshit and basically say, fuck it. And go out in style. Anyway, I don't really know and I really don't care. I just know about the bullshit that's happening around the world and basically a bunch of idiots like 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 uh, like Zachary basically having access to computers, being able to type in things and make you look good. It's like, uh, yeah, other people can do that too. And, you know, then they go after you because they get sick of your shit. Anyway, but Bill Gates is Zachary, and, uh, or some name uh, goes back to his hall. As soon as he posted that picture of the teletype room, a lot of people remembered who he was. It's like, yeah, he was supposed to be the hero of that teletype room. Say, you know, it was, it was a cover story for the fact that he supposedly wrestled the gun away from somebody, but it was a fake thing. He was actually the hostage taker. He actually uh, uh, grabbed, the, him and his friend grabbed the gun from the, from the police officer and then shot the police officer and then raped the, 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 the girlfriend of the police officer. So anyway, but they made a movie and posted some other bullshit, you know, basically calling him a hero, but he's not a hero. He was actually the guy who sodomized and then had sex with, with all the girls inside the classroom and got away with it, kind of, sort of, but not really. He spent a couple years in jail. Anyway, but he was a, but, but he was a underage, underage person and basically tried to seal his records. But anyway, his name is Zachary or something like that, and he's basically just a dork and a really stupid child. So... Anyway, I suppose his past eventually will catch up to him. Or did. <laughs>